Hey, it's Corey Pierce and welcome to FIFA 14 Career Mode. This is my Liverpool Career Mode. Uh, doing this today. Barcelona will be on uh, on Tuesday. Just so you know, I am recording this on Sunday evening. But it will be uploaded on Monday. So, just so we're clear. If it looks like my light is on, that's because, well, it is. <laughs> it is. And, um, I was, I've sorted out the team, you know. I've done a little fiddling. Uh, this, this year I'm not going to uh, go with the 4-3-3 that I normally go with. I wanted to try out a different formation. This year, I'm, with a little point, I'm going to have 4 3 1 2. And um, before I just start the matches, I'm going to read out my current squad. This is my current squad. It is set to change because I have some players inbound. But you're going to know it's one big missing name. If you can't tell already. So in goal we have Tobias Cotois. Now you're probably saying uh, straight away that's Minule who's missing. No, it's not Minule. He's he's on the bench. Um, yes, I really like Minule. He's a freaking legend. But Cotois' rating is much higher. Plus, um, Plus, Mignolet has not been exactly a legend in the last two games for Liverpool. We lost to Southampton and fucking drew with Swansea. I know I should have done videos on them, but I completely slipped my mind. I was very busy. Ugh. Oh, so shit. Anyway, my back line is Glenn Johnson, Vincent Company, Hummels, and David Alaba. David Alaba, the man is a legend. Um, I wanted to give you guys a pack opening, but I couldn't open the packs on on the um, on the early release. I had to open them on the web app, and I couldn't record it. But um, if you follow me on Twitter at Gordbeards4, link in the description down below, you would have saw I got. A Juventus defender, and thanks to David Alaba, I got in form Garay. That is what's up. But I promise you, I promised you a pack opening, and I will deliver the day the real FIFA comes out. The day I get in FIFA 14, the full release, all that good stuff. I will be open. I'll have a pack opening because I'm gonna get. A 20 year old PlayStation Network card the day I get FIFA the 14 and uh just gonna go ham with that so thanks to David Alaba I am gonna give him some extra wages just because of that um midfield we have Steven Gerrard Adrian who's a young Brazilian who I brought in but uh he he's only there as a temp, you will see why in just a moment after the game, after the first game, which is against Stoke, obviously, because you know, it's, it's going as it was in real life. Um, their midfielder is Royce. Yeah, I brought in Royce. Why not? Fuck it. Uh, and in the camp position, those are my ceramids in the camp position just behind the strikers. I have Philippe Coutinho. The man is going to be a legend this season. And here's where the big name is missing. Think about what I say now, okay? Strikers. First, Daniel Sturridge. And second, Robert Lewandowski. Now, think about it. If you haven't figured it out yet, it's Luis Suarez. Yeah, he left. I sold his ass. I got a lot of money for him. He actually went to Barcelona. He went to Barcelona. I don't know why. 
I don't know why Barcelona would want him. Um, was it Barcelona? Uh oh, spoiler! <laughs> um, Yeah, he he went to Barcelona for forty six point five million euro. Now that is a lot of money for a player who's not gonna play. <laughs> that is, that is just a real waste of money. Uh, I got Lewandowski for thirty million, which was pretty damn sweet. Um, I'm working on bringing in another striker. You probably just saw it. If you didn't. Then uh, prepare for a spoiler when it comes up in just a second. I'm working on uh, two new players in before the end of the window, just to just to spice things up. Nah, you're probably noticing that the, I, the music is not playing. I assure you, the game is, um, it's not on mute, it's not on mute. Um, I actually turned off the music because it was annoying me. And I checked my Assassin's Creed video that I uploaded earlier this morning. It had third party content on that. I was like, fuck it. From now on, anytime I get a new game, I'm turning off the music. Because it's it's annoying to get that notice on a fucking video. It always fucks up your video because it doesn't get as many like as uh, many views as and sometimes it doesn't register views for some reason. I don't know. Is there something different? It's, it's BS. Anyway. I gotta say this whole new screen is very nice. Um, it doesn't show you the um, opposition team anymore. So uh, their lineup I will not know until just before kickoff. Um, I'm going to assume that Stoke will have their best team out as well. Anyway, I'm going to let the in-game comes here to talk to you, so, to EA Sports Live enjoy the match. The Today, it's Liverpool against Stoke City. The floodlights beaming down from the night sky. So, without further ado, we're off to Anfield. Here's your commentary team, Martin Tyler and Alan Smith. Hi there, I'm Martin Tyler. With me today, Alan Smith, and we've got... The match of the Premier League for you. Yep, thanks, Martin. Delighted to be here, as I always am for these occasions. Oh, big day, Martin. The opening day of the season, always quite special. And for the home team here, high hopes of going for the Champions Cup place. You think they're capable of doing it? Come up against a side that uh, I think will be heading aiming for a Euro League spot. They've got some really good players down there, and this season could be a successful one for them. Austin Bailiff is our referee for this match. And it's Liverpool. We'll be watched by uh, many of the crowd, especially today. We've got the game underway. Well, he tried to find his man, but he's only put the ball into touch. Andy Wilkinson. Edrington. 
Shawcross. Edrington. And the defender, Rice. And the header is into the net. And that is a simply fantastic goal. Wonderful diving header. It was, and I think so often that is shy away from lunging at the ball in that manner. It can be dangerous, but he's right there. Well, if the cross was superb, the diving header was even better. Absolute beauty. So after the goal, we have opened the scoring here, 1-0. He read it, cut it out. That's a clever little clip into a teammate. Now Johnson. He's in for the chance. He loves these situations. The referee's got to manage this match. And giving the foul, I think it's quite a good thing to do. Liverpool under American ownership, of course. Uh, a bit interesting, there's a suggestion of the money ball methods that you only buy players of a certain age, but certainly Brendan Rodgers, the manager, has a, a way of playing that, you know, it's, it's his way of... Oh, he's going to shoot now! Oh, the shot was blocked! Gerrard with the ball. So we're going to have to go from the back, from the goalkeeper, to come out and pick this up. Coutinho, Sturridge, that pass, just subtle with it, taken on the ball, he's really connected, well done the keeper, he's got the goal, but he's got to the ball this time, in a second save in a matter of seconds. That's something to do before, and back to them, because they had American ownership before. Now they've got the Fenway Sports Group from from Lee Henry. Brilliant out there. And now they've got the chance to push forward from this deepish position. <laughs> he really put his foot to the ball there. Yeah, Henry really did the job. Yes, now he's a long way out. You cannot afford to give him that man new new player. Now an, an interesting transfer, isn't it, to bring him here? Yeah. I mean, he's done okay early on. Now by the Liverpool man. Goalkeeper, it's straight at him. Coutinho. Here he is with the chance. Got to me. I score. Setting the standards here, the skipper. Yeah, just when the team wanted somebody to lead from the front, he's done it yet again. I think he's got ice running through his veins, this boy, because his clinical nature there to the bottom corner knew exactly what he wanted to do. Has made it 2-0. And towards Steven Gerrard. Gerrard with the ball. Good movement to get to it. And the shot's off. Pushed back into play by the goalkeeper. Sturridge. Oh, he's managed to hold on to it this time. Header there has gone straight to his team, but they kept the move going well. Headed on, anticipated well, so it's it goes for goal! <laughs> He's heading that down well, kept the ball up for his team. Yeah, the team may collect it. <laughs> Daniel Sturridge. That's the goalkeeper's ball. He's kept it. It's not getting away from him. Half time now, and 2 0 is the score at the break. So we reach half time. 2 0 the score with Liverpool leading. Let's take a look back at the highlights from that first half. And then we'll be straight back to your commentary team for the rest of the match. I gotta say one thing. The addition of uh, your man from Soccer Saturday is absolutely brilliant.
He makes the game, he makes it feel like it's real life. And then like, I guess EA thought, oh, let's make it a bit more realistic. Maybe that will make up for all the fucking trolls. At Anfield, the second half is now underway. They've got the ball back through. Opportunity here! <laughs> Referee's given them a free kick. In a real position of some danger to the opposition. And the turn from the curve, but you know Steven Gerrard doesn't miss too many. And he's already on the score sheet here. It's a debut, an official debut for him at his new club. A big signing too. He's a big signing and uh, hasn't always clicked for him at previous clubs, so this is a big chance for him. A goal! Oh! He scored with the goalkeeper nowhere in sight. Well, he's been able to just walk it into the net and there'll be some questions asked about this later. Well, the keeper's gone walkabouts, but what a guilt touch golden opportunity. Quick miss. And the score is 3 0. Stephen and Johnson. So it's the big day for the manager. A competitive match with his new team. Yeah, he's better to be nervous, isn't he? Because you want to get off to a good start. And the managers decided for a change of personnel. Coutinho. Lewandowski. Could be a goal. He shoots. That's the score here. The goalkeeper paying the price. The goal unguarded. The goal conceded. Well, chaos defensively, Alan, with the goalkeeper uh, a long way away from home. Yeah, but he won't score an easier goal than that in his entire career, will he? Glad to see this. It's another chance to see what was the super goal. Well, they're dominating now. Cornell on the scoreline. Even on Johnson. It's not easy to get the ball like this in midfield. You need a player with a bright mind, and he's done that, this player. Now, back to Gerrard. And it's Wilson. Daniel Sturridge, who else? Close red shot! And he takes the shot. Very good save and a very clean one as well. The ball didn't bounce off him. I see what he was trying to do. Just stretch the opposition by getting the ball out wide, but it's gone out for a throw. Shawcross. cross. Marco Royce. He's got space. There's Gerard. Gets his foot in there. Gerard. And his fans are always encouraging him to shoot because they know what he can do, Stephen Gerard. There aren't many out there that hit the ball as sweetly as this though. That is textbook from him. Steven Gerrard at his finest. We've seen it so often. He certainly did. A great stroke. It's very one-sided today. 5-0 the score. Well, this is really going uh, as expected, very much to fall. Yeah, that's not always the case, is it? But they came here expecting to win and they look to uh, be on course to achieving that. The uh, attack has fizzled out here. Goal kick.
Alaba has put that straight out of play. He's making a substitution and it's going to be a double change. Positional play of this player is really good. The player's done well here until it was the direction of the pass, really. Right idea, but couldn't find his man. It's over the touchline. That's the Edrington. Possession in the midfield area. Straightforward stop from an effort from a long, long way out. What a foul. The referees have seen the situation. He can play on. Chance for it. And he's got to go. And the referee points for goal kick. Henderson. Well held by the goalkeeper. Daniel Sturridge. Good challenge, and it needed to be. Jordan Henderson. Towards Lewandowski. He strikes a goal. Good <laughs> job of the ball by the keeper. Mm. Uh, getting set for the corner. Teammate here, who's passing onto that header, but he has to go. He's spotting it up now to take the corner. Stephen and Zonzi. Oh, well, the pre-season behind them, and all the talk about this game. Right <laughs> by the surface, first match ever, three points. Yeah, everything fits into place. Doesn't always happen after so much rehearsal, but. Uh, it's been a really good day for them here. So it's finished with the score, 5-0. I'll leave you with the full match highlights, and until next time, I've been Jeff Stelling. It really feels like a, I'm watching Soccer Saturday, except Liverpool never win 5-0 on Soccer, soccer Saturday. They barely ever win 5-0. Well, that's all from us here. Let's join Mike West for the classified results. Thanks, Martin and Alan. The Barclays Premier... OK, you can sh shut the hell up. I do notice that it does take a bit of time to load. I guess, you know, being that it's only, uh, like, it's only the, it's only the demo. I mean, it's not, well, no, not the demo. It's, it's only the, uh, it's only the early release. I'm assuming that the full release won't be this late. Yeah. Uh, uh oh unacceptable 67 million Jesus Christ uh what you just no I didn't get any message from Daniel Hager Oh, you're bleeding me dry, city. You're bleeding me dry. It's only because I really want to sign such a girl. Ah, that's right. I know. I know. I normally 
would have put him on uh, beforehand, but I actually wanted to try out because I purchased the uh, the takeover. Yeah, I did. Why not? Because I could. So I did. And now, in Karimo, I am rich. With Liverpool. Barcelona, not so much. Well, I, Barcelona had 70 million to start with. They don't have that much money now. <laughs> they kind of spent most of it. Oh, who am I kidding? I spent all Who am I kidding? I spent all of it. On who I don't know. I think it was El Shirari. Maybe I shouldn't have paid 22 million for. Dang, and this is not the career mode to talk about what I did with Barcelona. This is the career mode to talk about Liverpool. Barcelona is tomorrow. Well, it's, it's tomorrow for you guys. And this is up. It's Tuesday for me. Yeah! Get back into your position! Never leave again, Javi. Welcome back, Mr. Alonso. So, right, he's back, bitches. I told you, Adrian was only a temp. Javi Alonso is back. And better than ever. The partnership between Javi and Stevie G is alive and kicking once again. Whoa, 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 who the hell is Jordan Henderson? You think you're keeping 14? You've got another thing coming, buddy. You can have a different number. Here, think about what you did. I wish you have two strikers on my bed. To not, um... And, uh... Touch you. So I'm going to move Agar to my bench. Maybe that'll shut him up. And get him to leave me alone. So I'm going to have to take Wisdom away. But I will use Wisdom. I will use Wisdom as much as possible. Man, it's great to have the little... Legendary Xavi Alonso back at Anfield. This is what I think should happen in real life. Stevie G. Xavi Alonso. Philippe Coutinho. Brendan Rodgers. Make it happen. January. He. 2014. You know what to do? Do it! And then I'm, I'm also going to make Kotwa number one. Because I can. Uh huh. Like I said, I'm going to switch. I'm going to give. I'm gonna give Robert Lewandowski the number. I'm gonna give him the number nine, and I'll give Aguero number seven. Why not? David Alaba. Whoa, 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 ass fast. That number is retired. Here, you can have 25. No one's using it! Ha!
Um, number five, number six, number six. No, seven, eight, and um, can't think of a lower number for this for um Alaba. Maybe he likes being twenty-seven. I don't know. Think I've never heard of a, a player complaining about his number except for um, oh, what's his name from Man United? Valencia. Valencia didn't like being number seven for United. According to uh, I, I, that, that's according to um, Moise. Um, by the way, if if by the time this video goes up on Monday, Moise isn't sacked, I'll be very surprised because Man United lost four one to Man City. They got destroyed. They got the D from City. They want to go with find a rocket and hide for the rest of the season. I'm gonna give. I have to give him. Um, They are except in my bed, I'm just weighing on Aguero. <coughs> oh, he's after handing in a transfer. He's after handing in a transfer request. <laughs> oh, I guess that. I guess there's only one place he can go out now. He has to leave now. I was wondering what was going on. I was wondering, it was like, are you, when are you gonna let me know what's going on? Wow, it is really slow. But Sergio Aguero is in, bitch! Tough shit, Real Madrid, you lost, bitch! Aguero is mine! Oh, mine! <laughs> I don't know. I'm really surprised I got Aguero there because normally in that situation I would have gotten the I got I would have gotten some EA cheese. EA would have really said, you know what? We're gonna give him to uh he's gonna, we're gonna have him go to uh 
to Real Madrid. Just piss you off. Laggy piece of shit. Sorry, laggy or too sensitive to them button. But, um, either way. It's pretty bad. <laughs> and uh, Sergio Aguero actually scored two goals in that game where Man City beat Man United. So, um, yeah. Um, what am I doing now? Oh, yeah, I was uh, changing Aguero to number seven. Next game is against Aston Villa. Two, uh, two uh, interesting changes for, from the team that I uh, used to beat. Stoke in the first game, but two very necessary changes, may I remind you. They were very necessary. What the hell? Oh, good to know there's a airport now. Because I, I really want to uh, to test my uh, skills out against my... Opponents. ...coverage of the Barclays Premier League. Today it's Aston Villa against Liverpool. So without further ado, we take you to Aston Villa. Here's your commentary team, Martin Tyler and Alan Smith. Alan Smith is with me. I'm Martin Tyler. Delighted to have your company for this match today. <laughs> I'm back in front of their own supporters today, Martin, second day of the campaign, and uh, I think we are looking at a mid-table side here. I don't like to say that so early in the season, but uh, I don't see them finishing any higher than that. Up against a team that uh, I think can cause a lot of problems at the top of this division. Here it is with a chance. That's very well read. Well, that's back up the post. Ashley Burrowbridge. He's the match official today in charge of this game. Coutinho. Who's Alonso? Great opportunity, not to be. He has made an immediate impact with this goal. Oh, the perfect start for the ladder. Did he take it well? Well, this is top-class football by a top-class team. 
and they've got a goal to remember. Right, as good as the move was, the finish is absolutely exquisite. Yeah. Well, took a while but um, I think it will be worth it because he is a talented player Lewandowski they've got the ball back through a very good interception oh worth the try looks great when they do come off and it's going to be a goal instant impact. That's often the case, of course, but now it's the second competitive game in his jurisdiction. First red shot, and he has a goal. Lewandowski, that will mean a lot to him, that particular goal. Well, the first goal is always important for any player, and that should enable him to kick on and feel a lot more comfortable now. Well, they've been making so many chances, and this one's been taken splendidly. They've so many playmakers, haven't they? Players that can pick out a pass, and it's just too much for the opposition. Lewandowski. Here's the opportunity. Got a chance to cross. Played into the middle. Chance for it. That's a great clearance. And the shot's on. Lewandowski. He's scored a second goal here, and he's showing his new fans what he's made of. Yeah, he's, he's settling in and looking better and better by the match. And these couple of goals won't do him any harm at all. Liverpool really on top form in their first half. Could be a goal. Robert Lewandowski. That certainly will help him fit into his new surroundings. Alan wanted to get two goals here. I think so. He would maybe have just started to play on his mind. The fact that he hadn't uh, found the score sheet. So, yeah, he'd be delighted with that. Coutinho. And they've cut it out. Can he turn away from the challenge here? El Ahmedi. before they've really got to close it down quicker. That is what the fans love to see. A goal hit like that. Well, they're dominating now. Four nil on the scoreboard. 
He's got that, cleared the ball away, and saved his son. So there we are, half time. First half comes to a close here. I mean, one I'm team that has yeah. dominated the first 45 minutes. For the winning team, Martin, it's just a question of uh, carrying out the second half in a professional manner and seeing through this victory. So we reach half time. 4 0 the score with Liverpool leading. Let's take a look back at the highlights from that first half, and then we'll be straight back to your commentary team for the rest of the match. They've got to repeat that and do it from their point of view, try and spoil the day from the side that seems to have this match won. Gabriel Alonso. Well, he's lent the ball to his mates. He's got it back again. Almost. Marco Royce. Tremendous understanding from these players. Hummels. Foul against Liverpool. I wouldn't be surprised, that's a bit of a cliche for managers speak. Uh, silence the home support if you can. Uh, and that helps the uh, the underdogs to play better. Uh, well, they've certainly silenced the home support. Have they? And, and they've done it by playing some really good football. They'll be uh, delighted with a day's work. This is an opportunity for them to break out from the back. And the player goes for goal! Wonderful finish! He's doubled his money here with two great goals. A good finish, no doubt, Martin, but what about the play before that? What about the passing? A wonderful team out They've made it by a bit. This player will always try that sort of thing to back heel, and often more successfully than on that moment. He takes the shot. Terrific shot from Gerard. Well saved. Now it's a corner. The defender's done very well to clear that. Oh, he's going to shoot now. Well blocked. I uh, saw it all the way, the goalkeeper, and it's comfortable in the end. You're thinking for the away side, time for a change. Hummels. Javi Alonso. Home team have some work to do um, because they've lost their last two games. They've got home advantage and they need to win today. Yeah, they do. I'm sure they need to put their own fans, but I'm not to do it here, actually. So they can regroup now at a goal kick. see players being replaced now and substitutes ready for both sides. Steer back to the goalkeeper Courtois. They've got the ball in the middle of the pitch here. Some options on the bench for the home team. Javi Alonso. An exciting debut for the player who was taken off earlier, but very promising. Lots of potential with his player. He's only going to get better once he properly gets to know his new teammates. Well, it's uh, one change 
and it looks like it's a case of just trying to freshen the team up a bit. Right in quickly to try and win the ball back. Daniel Sturridge passed his man there. Well held by the goalkeeper. Defending there. Nice touch. It could be a chance here for Liverpool. Could be a goal. Good work from the keeper. And the shot's off. Catch his goal. And looped it into the empty net. Looking at the replays, the keeper's hardly ever in shot. He's so far away from his base and uh, the scorer couldn't have had a simple touch. That's right. How many times you get a completely open goal like that, but this is one of them. This is looking pretty humiliating. 6 0. Well, we wonder whether it will be more competitive, but in truth, I think we both suspected that it would go this way, Alan. Well, there is a golfing class between these two sides, and that golf is shown out there on the pitch. There's been some good football play by, by the stronger team. And on the clock, eight more minutes. Now, company. Substitution here for the home side. Steven Gerrard. And the keeper able to hold the shot. He's got space. He's got the goal. All credit to them for looking to score more goals even though they're in front. Time now for the manager to show their hands with their substitutions. Both managers are going to do this. Well, he saved it and he's kept him as well. Two minutes and time. The positional play of this play is really good. Final whistle from the referee. Liverpool have won. Well, that's, that's really big <laughs> so, start off. Start FIFA 14. Oh, I finished off FIFA 13. Absolutely dominating. Never mind. Actually, never mind finishing off. How I spent. FIFA 30 on career mode. Absolute domination. Mm. Mm. Great start. Both Sergio Aguero and Robert Lewandowski both off the mark. And a nice goal there for Xabi Alonso as well. Oh, oh I have two messages. Could be uh, in here. I, Adrian can't complain. I did play him. He asked to be played. I played him. Hmm. Who did I get? Oh, Agar. Daniel Agar. I'm gonna see if I can get nine million for uh, for Daniel.
So, um, good start to the career mode. Next game is, um, I'm not sure who the next game is, but I will win whoever it is. <laughs> So, good start for me, good start for Liverpool. New FIFA, same old story. Like, comment, and subscribe.